The FDR Drive is now back open after an overnight crash caused a major morning headache for commuters. Take a look at this video. A tractor trailer got stuck under an overpass, snarling traffic for hours and forcing drivers to find an alternate route. Lisa Evers is live on the Upper East Side with the details. Lisa. Well, Chris, drivers here in the city, and I'm one of them, are used to traffic jams and big delays. But what happened this morning had even the early bird drivers shaking their heads. Now, there was a major shutdown of the FDR that happened early this morning. Both lanes, as you can see, are reopened now, but it was a rough start to the week for many. Just before 3 this morning, police tell us a tractor trailer truck heading southbound on the FDR got stuck under the 90th Street overpass because the truck was too high. The NYPD set up a detour at the 96th Street exit to get cars off the FDR so crews could get to the stuck truck and figure out how to move it out. For about seven hours, the almost always packed highway was shut down as they tried to clear it out. Drivers who thought they were getting a jump on the morning rush hour traffic got a rude awakening and found hours of delays. Here's what some of them told us. Traffic is horrible. I'm almost two hours waiting and I just have to go out because I'm late to my way. What I'm going to do? There's nothing I can do about it. I just have to wait. Terrible, terrible this driving. Oh my God. I can't believe you're not over here only to come here only to, to 60 exit. 40 minutes. I'm coming up from uh, from Tenafly over the bridge took me over an hour. Too much traffic, I don't know what's going on today. I don't even know what's going on, but three hours in 7.20 this morning, been in traffic. Now, both lanes are reopened now. The NYPD tells us there were no injuries as a result of this, and it's good news that that traffic is moving for the drivers here. Reporting live from the Upper East Side, I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News. Chris, back to you. All right.